The only thing that these kids are guilty of is is not giving a fuck. What's good, YouTube? You're here. I'm here. Do me a favor. Hit the like, share, subscribe button. All them shits is free. Now let's get into this. All right, everyone. So today's article, uh, pretty basic. It's uh, you know a bunch of bunch of kids who've been locked down for two plus years, uh, a little bit more almost, and uh, now they finally get a little freedom. Obviously, everybody on this plane is vaccinated. And uh, let me, let's just run through this real quick. Passengers on Sunwing party plane could face jail time, thousands of dollars in fines. A group of Quebec influencers and reality show stars could be facing thousands of dollars in fines after videos surfaced of them partying with masks without masks on board a Sunwing flight from Montreal to Cancun. Images from December 30th flight showed passengers ignoring public health measures, jumping and dancing in the aisle, vaping and openly passing around a bottle of hard liquor on the plane. In one video, a person could be seen crowd surfing while the plane was in the air. The federal government released a statement Tuesday saying that the departments of transport, public safety and health have all launched investigations into the incident. There could be fines of up to 5,000 from Transport Canada for each offense on board, it said. Additional fines and even jail time could follow if passengers were found to be endangering others or if they provided falsified information upon the return to Canada. So here's a few seconds of some bullshit. Oh, God damn. Audio cuts out right there. Um, apparently, Justin Trudeau, blackface, Mr. Blackie, Tyrone Trudeau, says it's a slap in the face. Prime Minister Justin Blackface Tyrone said Wednesday he was extremely frustrated seeing the videos. It's a slap in the face to see people putting themselves, putting their fellow citizens, putting airline workers at risk, being completely irresponsible. And I'll let him, I'll actually let this bitch ass say it in his own words. And today, blowback from the Prime Minister. And it's a slap in the face. It's a slap in the face. To see people putting themselves, <laughs> putting their fellow citizens, putting uh, airline workers at risk by being completely irresponsible. Yeah, this guy always has like a box of tampons in his mouth. So this guy right here, James William Awad, uh, or Awad is probably how you say that. He was the organizer, event organizer, and he's like, I take this matter very seriously. A simple party on a plane did all this buzz. You know he's loving it. I will like to take a moment to sit down and rethink everything, especially how I could do things better next time. Give me a moment to understand the situation better. Now, all I know is, this guy is going to probably get an increase in sales on party packages because if that's how they turn up on these types of flights, then why wouldn't anybody want to be there? And especially if you're one of these college youths, influencers, you got, you're good looking, you got money, you got time. What the fuck are you going to turn up? You're going to have a good time. You're going to do what you, you feel like you got to do article is talking about they're passing around a bottle of hard liquor i think it was gray goose they're passing around some goose so if everyone's drinking from the bottle you know science alcohol it cancels out okay you can't get the coof and even if you get the coof you only live once anyway so turn up like let's not play this dumb game um i do recall in the beginning of the pandemic a lot of the MPs and premiers and even this uh, Foss box right here, uh, this this little Fossy hole right here, this guy, he went on vacation and uh, we couldn't say shit about it. So in normal fashion, Justin, and the rest of you Karens and what do you call a guy Karen? I guess you call him a, a Ken. All the Kens and Karens out there, you guys can kick rocks. That's uh, That's something you guys can do. When I was uh, in college and uh, in the partying stage, 
we used to take party buses to Montreal, Quebec, and those buses were lit, okay? Anything went down on those buses, anything goes. So from a quick ride, a six hour ride from Toronto to Montreal, all types of debauchery used to get down. I've been on many, well not, I, I took a couple trips, very memorable, very, very memorable. So Quebec partiers, influencers, some of the world's renowned uh, clubs out there, these kids know what they're doing. They're just trying to have fun. Justin, suck a dick. You're a black face. Nobody's listening to you. At least I'm not listening to you. That's what's really hood.